Enjoy Your Legacy is just a mission and a vision and a crusade that I actually founded. My name is Teresa Martin and I am the founder of Enjoy Your Legacy. People spend so much time trying to have a legacy, but little time in trying to enjoy that legacy. So I created this Enjoy Your Legacy for those people to let them know that not only is it important for you to have a legacy, but you have to take time to enjoy that legacy. The biggest challenge that minority women face in America today is giving into the microwave society. The microwave society that we live in says that I want it now. You can get it now. You don't have to pay for it now. You want it now. So you go out and get the biggest house that you can't afford. You go out and get the biggest car that you can't afford. When we say legacy, we think about money and things, stuff. That's not what legacy is about. Legacy is building upon principles that your family can build upon and grow to the next generation, to the next generation. An empowered family changes a family tree. If we just start changing the mindset, now we can start changing the generations. And I specifically talk to the minority woman, you're phenomenal without the big house. You're phenomenal without the big finance package for your car. You're phenomenal as long as you do the things that's necessary to grow a legacy for your family and the next generation. Enjoying your legacy is really, really built on how we want to amass wealth, how we actually keep wealth, and how we actually keep the wealth growing. And wealth means different things to different people. It's not always money. It could just be security to know that I have these things in place. So my passion, my vision, and my mission is to allow women to love themselves. I want to give them permission. I want to say whether you're starting out or starting over, you're still phenomenal. If you are a divorcee or you're looking to get married, you are still phenomenal. If you have filed for, for foreclosure or you have filed for a short sale or you're already wealthy, you are phenomenal. I want women to know that you now have the license based on Attorney Teresa Martin saying so. You are phenomenal. And that's what the brand is about. That's what I'm about. And I won't stop until every woman knows that you are something special. You have the power. You have the key to the next generation. You are phenomenal. And I, I, I keep coming back to women because I'm a woman. I was a teen mom. And people would have had me labeled as a statistic, right? A statistic to say that, oh, she's a teen mom. She's not gonna graduate high school. She's not gonna go on to do anything. And, but for my circumstances, I sit before you today, you know, as a woman of God, as, as a woman who has graduated law school, who has accomplished so many things, but I came from a very strong, empowering family. My father was everything to me and his opinion mattered. So while I can't say that I always had this greatness inside me, I can always tell you that once I became pregnant with child and then had a child, I had something to prove to my dad because in his eyes, I was no longer daddy's little girl. That hurt so much that I, I just had to call him. And I said, dad, I've done everything. And I'm tearing up now, you know. You know. Um, I said, I've done everything. You know, I've gotten good grades. I graduated high school. I, I, I graduated college. And my dad on the phone broke down. And you know, if anybody knows, you don't see your dad cry. You don't hear your dad cry. That doesn't happen. That's a bad, you know, bad thing, right? He said, baby girl, you could have stopped at high school. But if I would have told you that, you would have. And so for that moment in time, I was now... 13 years old and I was again I felt like daddy's little girl again and so my challenge was really myself the journey that I've gone through helps me speak into the lives of families because I had the best family in the world to my to me things happen it happens because of lack of communication it happens for a lot of different reasons. And I am blessed to know that financially, we were always okay. And I came from a family that didn't hide the truth. 
but I know a lot of families that do. And so what drives me through my experiences is to say whether or not your child messes up, she or he is still phenomenal. <laughs> and always let them know that. I came from a father who told me, you can do anything that you want to do. There are some, there's some women right now looking at me right now and saying, I can't do this because, you know, I'm going through a short sale or, you know, I got divorced and my husband didn't love me. So how can I love myself? And I'm not worthy. So what I want to do is I want to take that and say, I understand my vision for enjoying your legacy, for all the things that I do is I want to see women, all the women that we come into contact with all the women that I don't come into contact with. We're gonna have a world where women are in financial leadership positions, in their families, in business, in the stock market, all these different things. Women are now going to see themselves in the positions in which they were destined to be. Financial leaders of their households. We are now going to take the biblical principle of Proverbs 31 and make it a reality across the country, across nations, and we're gonna affect the world because women are where the children lie. So my vision for women to enjoy their legacy is actually to create the legacy, manage the legacy, protect the legacy, and actually endure the greatness in which they were destined to be. That's my vision, and I'm just not gonna stop until I see women empowered and take the throne where they need to be. My name is Teresa Martin, and I want to help you enjoy your legacy.